This is before Terry. He's late. Maybe this is blue. Where are you, man? Where are you? We're waiting for you. Time management. Cha cha. This is Rachel and today I'm here with Terry and Leonard Hi guys, I'm Leonard Lim and uh, I am an Australian born Chinese living in Korea and LA and I am a good friend of Rachel and Terry's Yay! It's good to be here, it's good to be back here Thanks for having me back Rachel, I appreciate that My name is Terry, in terrible case you guys video. don't know Yeah, I make terrible content on <laughs> YouTube Thank you for watching my uh, terrible YouTube channel It's good to be here, Terry TV and he brought Max too. And I brought Max too yeah. for content. So keep Max away from my yeah. hand. <laughs> yeah, something yeah, happened. We had a little unfortunate yeah. um, incident, um, which Leonard, you can go check it out on his Yeah, on his Instagram. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> what? Did Sorry you about that. that. You didn't, um... What the Okay, but today is a very special day because we are starting a new series on this channel. Woohoo! <laughs> and it's gonna be called Popular Opinions! Hey. Hope you like it, hope you like this new style because if you do, we're gonna make part two. And, and three. And four. And, four. and millions. Yeah. The topic we're gonna do today is we've been stalkers. Why do you gotta pick stalkers? You know how many stalker videos I've made? Yeah, exactly. That's why we are starting with stalker topic. Uh, so we did some research online and then we collected some popular answers, popular confessions, and then we're gonna start mm -hmm. from number. Five. Number five, asking her friends how she was like in the past. Oh, it doesn't sound too bad. Yeah, I don't. Well, actually, yeah, I think I did that like in high school. Like, like asking around in the back. Oh, with that her not person. there? Yeah. I do it like with her there, you know, oh. to like just for fun. Yeah. You know, she did like kind of annoyed, but oh yeah, if she wasn't there, that might be a little more Awkward. intrusive. Hmm. I also think, you, you know, by asking that question, you're going to get a very, very biased opinion from her friends. Right. Too, mm -hmm. You know, her friends are always going to be like, oh, she's great. You know, there's not, there's absolutely right. nothing wrong with her. Unless, you know, they want to be really honest, but I feel like uh, they, uh, you're not going to get complete honesty out of her close friends. Yeah, I think it, it, I think it really depends on if she's there or if she's not there. I like joke around with my friends, you know, they're, they're, it's going to be very different if I'm not there. Or 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 in there because they'll be like, oh yeah, Terry, he's like the worst guy you can ever be with. You know, he's so so lame. Why? Right now. Why yeah. are you here? If I'm there, yeah, exactly. Yeah, right, right, right. They're, they're saying that right now. But if you're not there, I can't even tell this kind of joke because Terry's it's like, the worst. Yeah. He is the worst. <laughs> yeah. See, only when I'm here. But as soon as I go away, they're like, I miss that guy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They love me. That guy means the world, Terry. You guys love me. I mean, <laughs> asking this kind of question, I can relate to that because, of course, obviously, I'm curious, but. Uh, a more old-fashioned way I like to get to know the person by myself. I don't know. That's true. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like other people's opinions are like other people's opinions. But the best way to get to know your girlfriend, your boyfriend, is to just be like honest and ask the questions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Okay, number four. Okay, looking through his or her stuff to see if he still has a picture of his ex. Mm. Hmm. I think that's a little bit more relatable. I mean, like, yeah. I mean, I, what if he has one? Uh, do you guys erase all your pictures of your ex once you break up with them? No, not at all. I feel like there's a treasured... I, I'm a very sentimental person, mm -hmm. so I feel like, you know, yes, we were in a relationship, but that's also... That, I'm gonna get, go really deep here. No, okay. no go ahead. Yeah. Apologies. This is good. Apologies. Warning. Yeah, apologies. But like, yes, it's a relationship, but it's also very, very tight. Like, it's like the ultimate friendship, isn't it? So, I wouldn't want to completely erase that person in my life because that person was, you know, a big part of my life for a period of my time and I want to remember that. Mm. So, I think that like, yeah, keeping photos and, and memories of your, your ex is completely fine. But yeah. does it mean anything more than that to you? Because um, your current significant other could think differently. Oh, does it mean more than that? I think, I mean, it probably starts to be an issue if... Um, if it remains as their phone background, I think oh, if it remains as their phone background, no, no. then I think that you know that <laughs> then I'll start problem. asking questions. Mm. Hi, Max. Wow, look at the massacre down there. Oof, so, no, I was trying to um, <laughs> that's I, he made a little mess, which I have a clip I can show you guys, but he was doing something else before the mess. Uh, but <laughs> with the squirtle? With, with squirtle. Oh with my squirtle? God. Yeah. My so. hand and then squirtle? Yeah, so I first mean, my hand and then squirtle? You cheated on your head. You oh, cheated on your head. Oh, 
hit on my head with and the squirtle. Why squirtle? He was about to make squirtle. <laughs> don't say it. Don't say it. I don't want. Don't I don't it. want Rachel to get demonetized. Yeah, so don't say it. I'm just going to say he was about to make squirtle really happy. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they were going to be good friends. But anyway, Max, stop growing up, okay? Would you stop? Stop. Oh, he can't stop moving. Calm thyself. Oh, I see you so much. Calm thyself. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Just, just take my hand. <laughs> Number three, going through all his Facebook history, all the way back, all the way back, scroll, 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 scroll down. I'm guilty of this. How much time do you have? I mean, I don't know. I mean, it's like, I can't stop it. Oh, heck yeah. Yeah, I scroll down their Instagram. Heck right? yeah, their timeline. Right? Sometimes yeah. they got Twitter. It's like, scrolling yeah. that what shit. What were you, you thinking I mean? in 2014? Instagram, Instagram, yes. Facebook. Probably not, because like you just like you're gonna go all the way to baby photos, and it's just like, what's that really gonna? Yeah, you're gonna go to like 2009 when they're like high school and they got the thick frame glasses and like the worst Races. haircut ever, and it's just like, ooh, uh, nobody wants to see that. Well, that is exactly why sometimes I go deeper a little. What the? How? <laughs> Number two, sending DMs using my friend's account and seeing their reaction. Is this like a test? Yeah, catfish oh. testing thing. So like, if I was dating this girl, and then I'd send like hot model Leonard, like slide into her DMs yeah, and just see exactly. the reaction. Yeah. People, That's a, people do that. I mean, if, I shouldn't use Leonard though. She's gonna obviously leave me for him. <laughs> Have you seen if, his Instagram? No, 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 no. But if that happens, oh, no, no, that's a donezo. But also, don't you think that's like a huge like? Thing. That's like really questionable like thing baby. to do. Like yeah. Baby. Also, like. If it comes out positive, that's that's great. But at the same time, like you've kind of tested someone that you care about. When yeah. you know that already kind of is not a great thing to do. Your trust is tainted at that point. Correct. Yeah. You tempted them, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. If it was just like the intention behind it is very. I mean, you unsure. are the one who's crossed the line first, and you're gonna now blame this person for taking your bait that you planted. Yeah. Up front, I would agree with you, you know, like just looking at it from an ethical standpoint, I'd be like, oh man, that's kind of like a, like a effed up thing to do. It like, is. Just yeah. In the first place. Yeah. It is. Unless like it's a complete joke. But then like it turns out like she's like actually serious, like, hey, let's meet up at the motel diner, you know? It's like, motel oh, diner. This isn't funny. You know? And it backfired, yeah. yeah. And then if that's the case, what happens next? Do you actually let your I mean, it's up to you. It's up to you then. It's yeah, that, that, that's literally like... I don't suggest anyone do this. And it's surprising that this is like the second most popular answer. Yeah, yeah what the... So many people do this. Don't do guys. this. Don't do this. And the number one is sneaking on their cell phone. Ooh. So I guess like sneaking around, snooping, trying to like look through their... I actually Stop. don't even want to look at their cell phones. I mean, like, it's really hard these days to ever look at someone's phone because it's locked. Yeah, locked. Right? I've never actually even tried to look into someone's phone because I know it's locked. It's always well, locked. Well, you know, but sometimes lovers, your significant other asks you to unlock your phone to see some, to go through your... Oh, yeah, that's when I start sweating bullets, you know? Because if she sees some of the pictures, like, I have, of, like, Max, you know, she'll be like, what the... She'll be so jealous, you yeah. know, because uh, I cuddle with Max too much. So. Right. You know, I take a lot of cuties. So and like Max to be on your hand. Yeah, he'd be, uh, well, he doesn't put that on. Max, Max, well, Max, Max okay. like a pose. All right, Leonard. How's this is Max. How's my hand? He's camera shy. Okay. He knows when the camera's on him though. I don't know how he knows. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring, come bring Max to the camera. Just yeah, when the camera's on him, he knows. And he's okay. so shy. Uh, he, he acts like he's the most innocent little guy. Ah, uh, camera shy. <laughs> Here you go. He's a good little guy. Aww. Yeah. So well behaved. Oh, okay. Uh, Rachel, calm him down. Mike, you like the smell? You like the smell? Let's, let's test it. <laughs> <laughs> He's so calming me. All right. No more getting worked up, okay? All right, give me pop. Good uh, boy. Good boy. Yeah, yeah, so back to snooping, uh, as we got interrupted by our Max commercial break. <laughs> this video is sponsored by Max. And Max products. By them and Leonard's Max hand. Max. And Leonard's and hand. Le and Leonard's hand. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I would, I just feel like it's so taboo, like it's so like, like the act of like using anybody else's invasion phone, of it's privacy, a huge right? invasion yeah, of privacy, right? isn't it? Yeah. But then what if like, she's the type of girl or the type of guy that's like, well don't you trust me, right? Oh, I thought no. trust is everything, uh, it's huh? not about I thought you trust. trusted me, huh? Nah. What is a relationship without trust? Oh my god, you, you sound like a, such an opposite. You never had one of those? It's not about, not even about trust, it's about personal boundaries maybe? Mm. But what if really they say there are no boundaries of love? Wow. You know, what if they say that? Then, mm, you oh, got a real, I mean, a problem on your, 
on your toes. I, th I think there's a bigger problem at hand when with all those things that you've just said. Yeah. I feel like if they're asking all those things, it's like, oh, I don't really know. If so what? you guys never had issues like that? I don't even want to look at my boyfriend's phone. Yeah. Because I don't want to find something that I don't want to find. Or, I, I don't know. Have you ever accidentally found something that you didn't want to find? I have. Oh, actually. that's good. Yeah. All right. Sure. Good job. Well, don't let Max high five you though. What? Sorry. Oh, like, like, Max is the only one that yeah, has yeah, to yeah. get out. No high fives for Max. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sorry, Max. Oh, he's actually really being a good boy right now. Mm. We are triggering him. No, don't look at yeah. it. <laughs> but yeah, this is not something I would do. Mm. And I think like it's not something that I would have my girlfriend do. Because it's it's just like it's really yeah I know it's like it's just weird I think you should respect each other's privacy oh, yeah. respect your space you need space they need space they might not know it but you need space and if not send them to space okay I heard Boom. there needs to be some space that um, a cool breeze could fly in between I said it in English so it's like a little a cool bit breeze. I'm lost you're talking about like <laughs> I'm lost now. Yeah, okay good. so yeah talking about bodily I guess. know relationship <laughs> is when two people are there and then they need some space in between them so that a cool breeze breeze could fly me, between them. Let me illustrate and one breeze. Let me illustrate so this with my hand. So <laughs> Rachel was saying this is two people and they need space like this so that cool breeze can fly through the middle. <laughs> they were I'm, both I'm, so I'm dumb. Not really, I'm not really with it, Terry. I don't know. There is a beautiful it. way to say this in Korea. <laughs> oh there is? I don't think it Oh okay. Maybe it just doesn't Do you translate. Want to share? Well. How do you Maybe say not. Oh, is it like sexual? No, no, it's not. It's sexual. It's not sexual. It's not sexual. All right, guys. But that is it for this week's video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. So you know, we know that you guys love this popular opinion video, so that we could make part two. And if you don't follow part four, five. If you don't follow Terry's Instagram, Larry's Instagram, all the links will be in the description below. And I'll see you next week. Peace out, love you, and goodbye.